The crush of the commissioner for youth and sports, Mr. Aswo Kang, has denied being desperate as accused by Mr. Jesse Sui Jemot, special advisor job placement to the state governor, Senator Ben Ayade. He bagged his mind recently while addressing journalists at the State Job Center and Employment Trust Fund Calabar, which has caused a divide between them, stating that. Um, I really don't want to, would not have loved to join issues with the SA job placement, who is Ms. Rentley, my friend over the years, for over 17 years. We've been real friends. But if you do a small talk, like I would love you to do, around this facility, you would understand that there is a beautifully furnished office here for the special advisor job placement, who will be responsible for the day-to-day -day running of this job center. So I already have too much to chew, and then talking about sports development and all. Therefore, I cannot be possibly be desperate. <laughs> That's um, for me, I want to believe that he didn't say that because he knows me too well. Uh, for some of us who've um, been considerably a little, considerably comfortable before we came into government. So I think he knows that. But let me also say this as a matter of um, clarity. That His Excellency the Governor, who is the principal, understands better how he wants, the tone at which he wants his government to drive, to be driven. Political appointments were given based on geography. Political appointments were given some on capacity. Yet, some others were given for us to put food on the table. In all the categories, they are very important for politics. It is therefore important that we understand that you must know which one you fall under. Is not a product of those ones who just want to put food on the table. Yes. No. Neither am I a product of geography. No. I was appointed on the grounds of capacity. In this government, we have found a situation where even some people, I don't want to mention names were given offices, and the offices were so docile. Because that has been done, we need to clearly shape our opinion to also know where we stand. So, I wouldn't say more than that, but I'd like you to understand the point I'm coming from. The governor himself called me. We had discussed something about the job center. I had sold an idea to him long when I got into this office. And I said, let's create a solidarity point for young people who always have jobs. Yeah. It took one year plus for him to call me from Abuja one of those times and said, I think that it's about time you need to drive that job center now. And we tried to drive it to this point. And he said, go and bring an estimate and we did the project and we are driving the process. But I, knowing quite well that we have a special advisor job placement, I have also created an office for him who is responsible for the community. Don't forget that this is not just job center. This is Cross River State Job Center and Employment Trust Fund. It is nobody's idea, it is my ingenuity, it is the thought of the governor, and we are driving it as such. And then, very clearly, the governor reserves the right to assign roles to any of his political office holders as he deems fit and as he sees your capacity and your ability to play. I therefore do not want to join issues with my friend Jesse Jemont. Uh, he's my friend, he's my brother, he's my playmate. We've come 17 years of friendship. Achibong Jayama, Crush Power TV.